He should have been the best player in the world, but he went from bags of potential to bagging prison time. This is the tragic story of Robin Ho. Robin Ho was born in Sao Paulo, Brazil, in 1984 to a poor family. His dad worked as a security guard, and his mom was a house cleaner. Despite the crime, ridden neighborhood, Robin Ho chose football as his escape. To support his family, he worked at a parking lot, helping people park cars for spare change. Robin Ho dreamed of becoming a football player. His parents couldn't afford proper boots, so he played barefoot. His dedication paid off, and scouts from Santos, Brazil's biggest club, noticed him. Meeting the legendary Pelé, who worked for Santos, was the ultimate test. Pale saw potential in Robin Ho and pushed him to train with the first team. Santos was struggling financially, and key players left. The club turned to academy talents like Robin Ho. Former Brazil coach Emerson Leo took over and started Project Rebuild Santos. Initially, Robin Ho struggled, scoring just one goal in 14 games. Critics doubted him, but he worked harder, scoring six goals in 11 games, helping Santos reach the Brazilian Championship Finals. In the finals, Robin Ho's penalty kick secured the championship for Santos. He became a hero. However, the next season, Santos finished second, and Robin Ho's performance was inconsistent. Tragedy struck when armed men kidnapped his mother. Devastated, Robin Ho took time off, paid the ransom, and returned to help Santos win another championship. European clubs noticed Robin Ho, but Santos kept him for another season. He joined Brazil's national team and helped win the 2005 Copa America. In 2006, he moved to Real Madrid. However, he struggled in his first season. Senior players supported him, and he joined the 2006 World Cup team. Real Madrid star players left, putting more pressure on Robin Ho. Despite some good performances, he was inconsistent. Frustrated, Robin Ho left for Manchester City, where he initially thrived but soon struggled. Injuries and new signings pushed him out. He returned to Santos on loan, regained form, and joined AK Milan. Initially successful, injuries and changes in the team affected him. He returned to Santos but struggled. He later played in China, Turkey, and Brazil but never regained his form. In 2013, while at Milan, Robin Ho and friends assaulted a woman. In 2017, he was sentenced to nine years in prison, which he hasn't served due to Brazil's extradition laws. Robin Ho's story is a cautionary tale of wasted potential and poor choices.